A very good afternoon to all of you. I would like to welcome you all in our afternoon session as we do it every Saturday, where we bring you a lot of news, views, information, and the latest updates about real estate markets. First of all, I want to say thanks to all of you who participate every Saturday in the session and ask questions, put their own opinions, viewpoints, because that is what the objective of this session is. It is to spread the information and the knowledge as much as we can. And the simple reason behind that is, I want to make sure whatever I have learned in this country, in this industry, uh, which helped me to be successful, if my knowledge, my little intellect or whatever, a little I know about real estate industry, if I'm able to share my vision, my thought process with all of you, and it helps everybody to come forward and think a little differently to make their life better, I'll feel the purpose of me being on this earth has been fulfilled. Many times, uh, people come and uh, talk to me and say, you know what, uh, you really talk good. You talk all the good things. Guys, this is what I think is the real sense of being positive. At least, if we cannot do anything else, at least we can talk good. That is the least we can do to make ourselves a better person. Let me ask you. You and me, we all believe in feeding our body a healthy, nutrient food which doesn't impact in a wrongful way to our body. Who doesn't want to have a healthy body? But did we ever think with healthy body, the most important thing is we have to have a healthy mind as well. But Majority of the time, we don't even think that that way. Now, what is the nutrition for the healthy mind? The nutrition for the healthy mind is our thought process. What we say, what we speak. So make sure whenever we speak, whenever we say anything, whenever we discuss with somebody, we should have something good to talk, something positive, something energetic. There are so many people in the world this world is full of people who keep talking negative things. Sometimes they do it consciously, sometimes they do it subconsciously. But majority of the time, people do it unknowingly. So we have to make sure at least we don't do an unjust to us by feeding our mind, our tongue, and our surrounding with the negative thought process. Of course, when you are living in this world, there is going to be a lot many things which is going to bother you. But that is how it is. So you cannot change others. You can change yourself. You have to make sure that when you hear negativity, when you hear something which is uh, not really a very a positive mindset or positive aspect, you have to just simply shut off the door to your mind or so that you don't hear, you don't let those thoughts let those things go into your brain. And that is definitely going to give you a happy and healthy life and a healthy brain as well, which is going to help you to become a better person. I always try my level best to keep good, positive people in my surrounding because if you have negativity in your surrounding, they will keep feeding you something which you don't want to go into your brain. I can see there are a lot of people who are joining us today, I know it is a very interesting discussion how to make $100,000 without working. And we are going to have an interesting discussion on this topic. But before we start discussing this, let me just introduce an, another amazing personality who is who always keeps spreading positive thought process. Sometimes, you know, I know, yeah, he uh, gets a little angry with me when the job is not done properly he just sent me a threatening text message 
<laughs> and I think this is what I love about uh, our own Kamal Tomar. So Kamal ji, welcome. <laughs> thank you. Thank you for the, uh, I would say, amazing introduction. What can I say? <laughs> <laughs> I never meant to threaten anyone. Yeah, but... Uh, yeah, I mean, uh, my focus is like, okay, the work has to be done, you know, that's the prime focus. And I strongly believe in that. And uh, here we are working as a team. So I always try to push, you know, if my little push can, you know, make the things happen, then it's actually in favor of all of us. So yeah, and uh, I really, I was so uh, amazed to see this topic, although I mean, I mean, I have no idea what's, what's what you're going to discuss, you know, so it's like a something from you it comes and say that okay we are going to discuss i have no clue what you are going to discuss but it, this topic is very catchy to me and i would definitely like to have or grab this first uh, before anyone do right see there's a lot of excitement and i got actually a lot of text messages and uh, people said wow that is something interesting the how to make hundred thousand dollar so come on i was talking to nidhi uh, today morning and uh, i was just like you know uh, trying to go back into and uh, the, the days when I just came here in this country as an immigrant, and Nidhi was getting a $315 check for two weeks, right? And I was getting around $500 check. And at that time, we both used to sit together and talk about it. That's, oh my God, how can, like, you know, when we are going to make that six figure income in this country? Because, you know, that was a big dream. And I'm pretty sure, like, you know, when you, me, we all came as an immigrant to this country, and even today, there are a lot many new immigrants, new uh, graduates, youngsters. They are coming out and they are joining the industry with a thought process that how I can make six-figure income. That is so true. Everybody wants to do that. I can see. Come on, look at the look at the number of people who are joining us today, because I think uh, we are definitely going to uh, open up a. I don't know either it is a cane of worms or it is something. <laughs> so your last discussions has just, I mean, given a, another number, I mean, I would honestly like to discuss here is like my plan of getting and opening offices was, okay, fine. We can open, open say five, seven offices to start with in the month of Jan. But when this thing started going live and the kind of traction coming in and I'm telling you right now, while we're talking, I'm looking to sign up at least 15 new offices only in January. Forget wow. about that. So, I mean, that's what I'm saying. When you start something, it really converts into numbers or, you know, there is a big, uh, loud, um, uh, you know, audience waiting for that. See, Kamal, uh, and I think this is what I have learned in my life. It is all about looking at the opportunities, grabbing the opportunities, I have seen too many people, especially like in our, in our field, um, if I talk about the general clients, like either it is a buyer or it is an investor, many times they come and talk and they say, you know what, I am looking for a good deal. I'm looking for a good opportunity. But when you give them a good deal, when you present them a good deal, when you give them a good opportunity, they start getting afraid of it. And they say, you know what, what's wrong with this? And this is what always happens to people. When a good opportunity knocks at their door, they just keep thinking, thinking, and let it go. But Kamal, I'll give you a simple secret of my success. The moment I saw any opportunity, I made sure in my life that I try it. And uh, I'll, I'll put an uh, uh, example in front of you. You remember, uh, there were a couple of people who were talking to you about the franchisees. Yep, and yep. Uh, uh, they always like, you know, were like coming up with thousands of questions every time. There's nothing wrong to ask the question. But, you know, don't do not do the postmortem of the thought process. And by the time they again came back to you, the location where they were looking for was gone. And I always say, guys, any new opportunity, you should definitely seriously consider it. And you should see how that opportunity can work for you until and unless you don't try you don't know what is going to happen so Kamal before I open up my secret of how to make hundred thousand dollar without working see these two words at the end are very important <laughs> and I can see the traffic is increasing 
because a lot many people they want to know how to make hundred thousand dollars without working at least i will get to know that who don't want to work <laughs> <laughs> Okay. So before that, I want you to talk about a little bit about the franchises, like how the things are happening at Save Max, and, and you know this was a wonderful opportunity that we are giving an opportunity to somebody who does not carry a real estate license, and you can come and join this amazing profession. What's your take on to that couple? Yeah, I mean, um, I would only use a word is like crazy. What's going on right now, honestly, mm -hmm. and uh, that's very. Positively crazy again. I would add positive towards that because uh, in last uh, say I would say a month or so when we started even just discussing and that too at a very uh, local level, not really you know promoting it in a big way. I mean I see uh, almost the ratio is almost fifty percent. If I have to talk about say how many from the industry coming us and how many out of the industry approaching us. So I would say almost 50% of the people who are coming and approaching us and the good side about it is the youngsters, you know, I mean, with the age group between 25 to 35, they're ready to take these chances, you know, they're coming with some new creative ideas and they're saying, hey, we want to come and uh, join. Is there some space for us? Right. So I, I see this as a very positive trend wherein uh, we have all different uh, age groups we have a mix of demography we have people coming from all communities across the gta so it is a very positive thing which is happening right now and i see that almost brampton is almost over in our terms of our location availability mississauga will be getting over next week mostly so we are left with a couple of options in near to the, our surroundings and uh, definitely we are i'm talking to someone in cambridge kitchener and other places where we are looking to have our offices soon, maybe not even a month's time. Right. So Kamal, but the way we have got the response, the way people are approaching you, do you feel there was really a big vacuum in the industry? It was so much needed because many people, they were like directionless. You know, they were all just like, you know, uh, uh, working like, you know, working like zombies, I would say. You know, just just hitting their heads in the wall every time and i've seen a lot many realtors like you know going up uh into their career and then coming down because there was no guidance and i think i would definitely would like to put the onus onto the leadership because it is the failure of the leadership it is not the failure of the individuals see if i'm not able to give enough vision if i'm not able to create that feeling in my team where you know what they feel like uh we we have something to look on to we have something to think about it we have a way to grow in, in our life so if i'm not if i'm not able to if i am not competent enough to do so it is the failure of my leadership it is not their failure but just as a thought provoking process i would definitely put the onus onto those people as well because you know what who chose the leader if I choose the wrong leader to make a government, see what happened in US. I know there were many people who were feeling like, you know, they chose a wrong leader. Right. But again, like I'm not talking about politics. I'm talking about our own profession. And I think that is very, very important. So we are going to talk about very soon how to make hundred thousand dollars without working. In the meanwhile, we have uh, uh, I think Sachin joined us as well, but uh, oh yeah, he's he's back. So we have another uh, interesting personality of Save Max, Mr. Sachin Gupta. Uh, let's introduce him as well. <laughs> Sachin, how are you? I'm good, Raman. Good afternoon, Raman and Kamal. Good afternoon, Sachin. I can so see. How's I, can going? Of, I can see a lot of traffic on the show today. <laughs> oh yes. Even I, when I joined in before, I saw that around 60 plus people were there on the session. That's right. And it is actually... So I see a lot of interest for people who wants to make $100,000 without working. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> so what's your what's your take on to that, Sachin? You also came into this country as a new immigrant. And I know we know each other from those people. So, yeah. uh, you know, I think uh, uh, we used to talk at that time. Uh, and uh, you, you have seen this journey. 
from a very initial days. So yeah. I was like, you know, I was I was talking to Kamal and I was uh, sharing with him uh, when I came into this country as a new immigrant. It was a dream for us how to make hundred thousand dollars. That's right. But I think the two last words without working is attracting everybody. True. true very true. I remember, you know, uh, uh, Raman, when I got my lessons and you sat with me and you asked me a question, you know, Sachin, what is your goal? You know, what do you want to do uh, for the first year you have got your license? And I still remember the answer that I gave that, you know what, Raman, I was trying to look for a job which can pay me maybe around 30, 35 K. So if I make 50 K for the first year, I should be more than happy. Hmm. Right. So 100 K maybe at that time, it was not even a, a dream at that time. But so, one thing that I want to add over here is this because today the topic is very interesting wherein, you know, make $100,000 without working. And I was thinking, you know what, what I can talk about this topic. And I, I did some research. I you know went on Google and I put the same topic on the Google itself that, you know what, I want $100,000 without working. And let's see what Google says to it. <laughs> oh, that's an interesting thing. So what was the answer? So... Google gave me a lot of options, you know, they told me that, you know what, there are 15 ways wherein, you know, you can make money uh, without working. Uh, some of them is that, you know, just no, on top no, of your head. Don't, 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 don't share all the secrets from Google. <laughs> That's not a good idea. I'll just give two or three. No, so no, they no, said, no. you know what, these no, no, days. No, no, we will talk, it, we will talk about it later on. Okay? okay. I have to open up my box. Okay. <laughs> Am I right, Kamal? Definitely, definitely. Yeah, he's sharing all the secret, right? That's right. Yeah, so we will talk about this, how to make $100,000 without working. But before that, Sachin, what is your take on, on the franchisee system and, uh, you know, the way we are getting the response, especially from those people who are not having the license? Yes, and you know, have already signed like what, five or six franchises under the FOCO model, yes. which is uh, uh, a franchisee owned and corporate operated where we are giving an opportunity to those who are not carrying the license. It's so, an amazing model, Raman. Again, we have discussed uh, many times about this model. This gives an opportunity to a common man without even having a real estate license, wherein, you know, this has been perception that has been created in the market is that real estate is meant for people who has a real estate license. Hmm. Okay. If you do not carry a real estate license or you are too busy doing your own stuff, you do not have right to open a real estate business or you cannot use your entrepreneur skills or your business management skills in real estate industry. And that's what we are. We have brought in a change to it. See, as I said before, is that to run a franchise of Tim Horton, you don't need to make a, know how to make a coffee. Till the time you know how to market your 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 uh, I would say location. Till the time you can drive in the customer to your location. Till the time you can provide best services to your clients. Somebody can make coffee for you. The same way in real estate, uh, you can start a real estate business without even having a license. Somebody else can do a real estate transaction, but you should know how to manage it. You should know how to generate business for your realtors. You should know how to provide the best service to your clients. And for that, you don't need any real estate license. And uh, on top of it, I think Sachin, the way we have uh, put up all the things together, uh, that is a very unique in its own way. Yeah. Uh, because uh, before this, uh, uh, this entrepreneurship in the real estate industry was considered to be only for the elite class. That's right. You, me and Kamal, like we are common people here. We are not like kind of very, uh, I would say very high end people like or very high. Uh, uh, I would say like you and me don't. We really inherited a lot of, you know, assets for us where, you know, we can we can build our empire on the basis of those inheritance. That's right. Yeah. And right? Also, like we are not engineers or, yes. or scientists or like, you know, uh, that kind of stuff. But we are we are a group of common people. Thinking, doing uncommon things yes. in a structured way as a team. Yeah. And I think that is what the uniqueness which we have created in our system. And that is what the beauty we are carrying. And I'm so happy to see that this beauty is spreading. But unfortunately, there are many people like uh, uh, actually uh, somebody got uh, 
little upset with Kamal two days before. And they said, okay, we are asking for a franchisee and you are not giving us a franchisee. And this guy was after Kamal's life from last four months, every time bringing up an excuse. And Kamal said, sir, we gave you an opportunity at that point of time. Unfortunately, you lost it. Somebody else grabbed that opportunity. We're just not going to keep holding ourselves because you are thinking sitting at your home to grab that opportunity. So it is too late for you. And same thing is Sachin, uh, I was speaking to uh, one of our uh, uh, colleague actually who just uh, got a franchisee and, and Mississauga yeah. and he was like, Roman, I'm not uh, like, you know, I was surprised to see that I was after Kamal from last six months to get the franchisee for Save Max. And that opened my eyes and I said like, wow, so there is so much need of some system. There is so much requirement of that vision in the real estate industry because right. two people just captured it and they were scaring others Yeah, that this does not belong to you. Yeah, And uh, I was very shocked to hear some of the comments as well. Uh, you know, even uh, sometimes people were telling people like, okay, this, uh, maybe you don't fit into that system. You, you are like too, uh, uh, maybe not that educated. Come on guys. We all came here. We all are educated. Right. You know, again, since I am dealing with a lot of franchises directly and indirectly through Kamal, and uh, I am listening to a lot of things which even surprise me. I would say surprise would be not the right word. I would say shock would be a right word for that. Wherein, you know, they told me that, you know what, when they approached their their existing mentors or, you know, they went to the team leaders and they told them, you know what, we are working towards opening our brokerage. So instead of encouraging them, uh, there was a kind of discouragement happening that, you know what, brokerage business is not a profitable business or this business is not meant for you. You will make more money as a realtor. Why to go into the next level? Right. And I, I was surprised, you know, listening to those things that, you know what, if somebody is aspiring, working hard, whether he makes money, it will be profitable. That's total afterthoughts. But ultimately, at least he's making an effort. He's doing hard work to go to a next level. Instead of we all should, you know, get together and encourage him to go to the next level. We are just pulling the legs. Yeah. And that should not happen. No, you know, ultimately, the, we all are colleagues. If somebody is trying to grow and next go to the next level, we should try and encourage them. Yeah. Whether they work with Samex or they don't work with Samex. For, as far as I'm concerned, even if they want to grow in their own system, I would... Glad to help them in, th in that also. Yeah. And uh, Sachin, so why don't we do something interesting? Like I was about to talk about over today's topic, how to make $100,000 without working. Why yeah. don't we take some of the opinion from people? Like, you know, what is what is their take onto this? Like, you know, I can, can I ask uh, all the viewers, like, you know, guys, uh, if you don't mind, you can put your own remarks and you can put your own thought process and share that how we can make 100000 without working. So I would love to have some of the people sharing the remarks. I can see a lot of people are joining today. Everybody's excited to know. Uh, and definitely I'm going to talk about it. But before that, let's give everybody an opportunity to share their thought process. And you guys tell me, what is what do you think about it? Right? In the meanwhile, Sachin, we can keep talking about what we were talking. So on that topic, you know, I, there's a story that, you know, I read somewhere or I heard somewhere, you know, that there was a, there was a well and there was a lot of frogs in that well. And one frog, he was trying to get out of those wells because they were stuck over there for quite some time. All other frogs, they tried to tell him that, you know what, you can't go out, don't try for it. And they are keep yelling to come back. And he kept trying for it. And one day he went out. So, so everybody asked that frog, you know what? Everybody was pulling your leg. Everybody was trying to tell you that, you know, you can't do it. It is not meant for you. You can't get out of this well. How come you came out? And then they realized that that, that frog was deaf. He couldn't hear what they were saying. So he was thinking that they were all are encouraging him to go out. Yeah. <laughs> so then I got some interesting answers here. Yes. So, uh, I got an answer from Rajat Bhatia. Yeah, he is from uh, uh, Edmonton. Edmonton, yes. That, uh, uh, to that, Google said contact Save Max. <laughs> <laughs> I got another answer from Aiden. Aiden said, maybe passive income through collecting rent or land appreciation over time. Uh, Aiden, your answer is uh, is decent. But again, 
for that also you have to work you either have to buy a property you have to go to collect rent and you have to buy a land to get the appreciation so that involves some of the work to make make money to make hundred thousand uh, dollars let's see some of the other answers uh, Sachin Gary said uh, I guess it is a good time to switch job jobs are already bad enough so making money without working sounds good whether it is 100k or more or less uh, but Gary again my answer is uh, yes uh, to do that job you are again working to make that hundred thousand dollar but I want to know from you guys how to make hundred thousand dollar without working that is what is the topic of discussion today so I wow there are a lot of uh, people who want to share like uh, okay let's uh, it's just winder it says just winder said no gain without pain some goes for wealth however I need to know your take no, so no. for sure just winder, I'm going to share my take uh, but I want to know from you guys how to make hundred thousand dollar without working and uh, so it's Jay's spring prime leaker I already made make hundred thousand by making the mind to join well-established system that wouldn't open opportunities in Alberta for me but whole Canada opening a wow opening a brokerage for finishing license uh come on does that uh, uh is is this one of our uh, uh associate uh, or team member or one of our uh new uh, yeah he can be but uh, i don't know because it's the name of the business showing up Kamal here Kamal has got too many now to remember <laughs> oh yes honestly telling you, you know what situation has come today in the morning before i was just thinking there is a fight for the location. Now there is another fight which has started is a uh, fight for the name. And there was someone who wanted X name which and someone else took it. But because again, it was the something which whosoever grabs first, you know. So yeah, I mean, those things are happening. But yeah, I mean, it's a good thing to happen. You know, it's a good pro problem to handle, you know, I would say. Yeah. And Jitin, Jitin said, create hands. Again, Jitin, if you want to create hands, you have to work for that. Um, uh, I can see like people are, uh, oh, Dr. Deepak Mahana from Calgary. He says invest in right direction. Deepak, you are very right. But still to make an investment, you have to work. I am looking for the answer from your side, how to make $100,000 without working. And you are right, Raman. Uh, the person who is from Alberta is our new partner joining us in Alberta, Mr. Nav. So he just oh. uh, sent me the details. Yeah, he is there. Yeah. Oh, I see. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. And I can see an, uh, another and uh, investing in real estate, maybe. Uh, Amir, uh, yes, that is one of the way. But again, like this is not the way without working. For this, you need to work as well. If you want to invest in real estate, you have to work for that, right? You cannot do investment. You have to go and meet a realtor. You have to go and look for the properties. I am looking for, I'm asking you, how to make hundred thousand dollar without working? Okay. Um, uh, it's Mr. Patan. He said invest in rent, but rental is going down. This economy, uh, Mr. Azar, uh, with due respect, I disagree with you a little bit. Rental market is not going down in this economy at all. But yes, there are few of the markets uh, where you might see a little bit settlement onto the rent. And that is just because of a temporary situation of this COVID-19. But in general, the market is really, really pretty hot at this point of time. Uh, I know Simran, uh, Simran is putting messages again and again. She's saying, I'm anxiously waiting. How without working? Suspense is building up. Simran, don't you worry. I'm definitely going to open up that suspense very soon. But I want to hear more people. I want to know from more people how to make hundred thousand dollar without working very simple and very simple question i think Raman, i love the answer that mr uh, rando has given if you love what you do then that's not considered work but still sir, it's, it's, still work. Work. <laughs> no, it's very it's very uh Aiden, i really appreciate and that is what i believe in my life uh and i always tell people uh that uh you know what if you love what you do you don't have to work but still it is a work i want to know how you can make hundred thousand dollar without working um there's an, another uh simi is asking can't wait to make money without working um simi thank you very much but right now i'm asking you guys how to make hundred thousand dollar without working i have gotten another answer from jaswinder jaswinder says do not work hard but work smart but jaswinder again that is a work 
that is a work which you are telling me right come on <laughs> but you have created enough sensation uh, <laughs> raman that now everyone is thinking you know what's coming up and i see our viewer viewership has gone 70 plus right now <laughs> but, the, but <laughs> okay but at least we are giving a thought provoking process to people yeah right and uh, uh, i think uh, uh, i have got an, uh, another answer from uh, mr dharmendra buy lotto max or join save max but again you have to work for that even the mindra to buy lotto max you have to work to buy the money uh, to work to earn the money to buy the ticket and still you have to go to the gas station or the lotto max or you have to open up your laptop so still that is a work right um mr chanda i have a successful franchise now it is making me money while i work for another company um uh, thank you mr chanda but still you have to work to get the franchisee as well such and i can see a lot of answer how can i give my answer i had namita is saying uh, magic uh, alka is saying uh, by investing in real estate mm, more guys passive income bala is saying passive income but again bala to get that passive income you have to work my question is how to make 100000 dollar without working and i'm going to share a good secret with you guys today but there are a lot of question answers there join save max and do not work no 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 just with that i don't know who gave you that idea uh, ask kamal ask sachin i make sure they work there <laughs> kamal is that so is that true <laughs> hopefully i and, wish and i can promise you you work hell lot <laughs> and dr deepak is saying let smart people work for you thankfully i am your friend but deepak still like you know you have to i am asking the question how to make 100000 dollar without working and i am going to share that i am going to uh, you know talk about it but i i can't do anything right now sachin i am getting a lot of answers which i want to share with everybody as he as is saying without working and without investing uh uh without working and without investing but sima i'm asking you how to make 100000 dollar without working okay zubair is saying rental income but zubair again we we talked about it um the the simple thing is in that particular case you still have to go and buy a property and you know to buy the property you still have to have money and to have to have that money you have to work Amir is saying Kamal has not taught me right then. Kamal, <laughs> Amir is our new intern. He just joined us around a week back. So, Similar is saying Save Max real estate retirement plan, uh, Save Max game changer model. Similar, but still you have to work for that game changer model, isn't that? I'm not. I have never told people that you don't have to work for the game changer model. You still have to work for the game changer model. right gobind singh kurana said what is the cost to open a franchise with save max gobind you can definitely get in touch with kamal and he is going to share all the details and of course we are giving uh, an amazing opportunity to people to open up the franchise without even carrying a real estate license and i think there's a lot of excitement onto that so kamal how do you find people take on to this what we are talking about that you can enter into the real estate profession without having a license so i will give you 3 minutes and then i am going to share my thought process with everybody how to make 100000 dollar without working but in that by the time i want to know more and more people if you can put up your thought process onto that and you can tell me how to make 100000 dollar without working please guys how to make 100000 dollar without working so come on please go ahead yeah so i would say if you are not having a license then definitely and you want to enjoy uh, the growth and the great opportunity of working in the real estate industry you can definitely own the business we will be your operational partner making the business profitable and taking all the hassles on us 
so right now i can only say that just give me a call and uh, we can discuss in length and i can share the break even i can share the total investment because it lot depends on uh, different areas we are talking about different situations we are talking about some of the investors who are coming they have their own office so my number is 416-333-8747 just give me a call and we can discuss more in length yeah come on i've got some another interesting answers from here first of all there's somebody uh is gorav shri vastava um, he is from Vancouver. Uh, thank you, Gaurav, for, for joining from Vancouver. Uh, just want to let you know, Gaurav, we are expanding uh, SaveMax brand in Vancouver as well as Kamal was on a business trip. Uh, Kamal, last week you were there, right? Yeah, last week I was there. And we are in a very serious discussion with a couple of uh, people over there to open up our uh, uh, you know, uh, franchises and master franchises in, in Vancouver and uh, uh, Surrey area and also come on what were the other markets Abbotsfords and where did yeah you... uh, Burnaby Abbotsford uh, that was in Kinoa was the other one and uh -huh. where we are looking to expand but majorly we would be starting from Surrey and Vancouver yeah I oh come on there are a uh, lot of another answers which I got here Paul Seri says become a same max franchise owner Ravi Marat says can can't wait to know uh, it's being a franchisee owner even without being a broker or realtor. Uh, impossible. We all have to work to get. Uh, Bilal says, <laughs> I got another funny answer here from Bilal. He says, marry a significant other with rich parents. But Bilal? A lot, of effort, lot of effort required for that. You <laughs> <laughs> work a lot for that. <laughs> <laughs> and in many directions, you have to go to work for that. <laughs> uh, Minu says, uh, really waiting now. Uh, Rishav, Rishav says, win a lottery. But Rishav, again, my take on to that is you have to go and uh, buy the lottery. Uh, Deepak Chopra said, work up front to build passive income sources, build a team of people. Uh, Deepak is one of and another amazing personality, which I met in my life. Uh, and, uh, you know, the way he is carrying Save Max flag in Edmonton and, you know, spreading it wings. And the best part about Deepak is uh, he is helping other people to be successful. He's helping other people to grow. And that is what the mantra with Save Max keeps spreading. Guys, leadership and success is not about you only. Leadership is about if you cannot inspire others to become better, to work better and to really perform better, then your leadership has no meaning. Uh, <laughs> I got another funny answer from Gary Bajwa. He said, borrow it from Deepak Chopra. <laughs> so Deepak, you have to be careful with this guy, uh, Gary Bajwa. Uh, he wants to borrow the money from you to make $100,000 without working. But Gary, for that also, you need to go to Deepak. You have to really, and believe me, I know Deepak very well. He is not going to give you a penny to borrow. <laughs> <laughs> Forget about $100,000. <laughs> uh, Gaurav said, I was AVP Mortgages with Yes Bank at New Delhi. Would love to meet you guys soon. Total 16 years. Save Max is doing a great job. Uh, Gaurav, next time when Kamal is visiting, I would love you to meet Kamal over there. Uh, <laughs> so now tell me, who wants to know how to make $100,000 without working? Anxiously waiting to listen to your magical words in the deep sets. Sachin, before I talk about how to make $100,000 without working, do you want to say something? Well, as I said, you know, when I was driving over here, I just thought that, you know what, what should I speak on this that, you know, make $100,000 without working? And when I was not getting the answer, I tried with the Google because Google has got answer to everything. So I asked Google that, you know, I want to make $100,000 and I don't want to move a finger for that. Is there oh. any way I can do it? <laughs> <laughs> okay, Sachin, before that, let me share a story with you. Yes. All right. And again, it, it just came into my mind. That has nothing to do with the, with the topic which we are talking about today. How to make $100,000 without working. So I'm definitely going to talk about it very soon, guys. Just hold your horses, okay? We have another 16 minutes, uh, another, sorry. Uh, 20 minutes. Huh? 20 minutes we have. Yeah, approximately 19 minutes. Yes. So let me share a story with you. So there was a guy. 
one day, one fine day, he got a mail. He got a letter in his mail. And in that letter, it said, do you want to make a lot of money? Do you want to make $100,000? If you want to know the secret, send me $10 and I will share the secret with you. So this guy was very excited and he sent $10 to the person who sent him that letter. And now he was waiting for the secret. But again, this is not, he still has to work into this, right? So this does not give the answer to over question, how to make $100,000 without working. So he wrote a letter back and sent $10 to that particular individual and requested him to send the secret, how to make $100,000. Now, after seven days, he got an, another letter back from him and said, please do the same thing. Please send the same letter, which I sent you first time <laughs> to another 100,000 people and you will get $10 from 10,000 people. But again, in this story, there is some work involved into this. You have to send the letters and all that stuff. But our question for today is how to make $100,000 without working. And I'm going to share my answer. I'm going to share my thought process when I see five people giving a thumbs up to today's discussion. So let's see how quickly we get five thumbs up. Come on. By the time I, I count five thumbs up, uh, you can... You can talk about you. You can promote your franchises. <laughs> <laughs> no, nothing to promote, Raman. Like right now, uh, I always just uh, share information and, you know, and it's a food of thought. And I always, whenever I meet uh, uh, these uh, uh, gentlemen or anyone coming for business, I always share one thing that... No, sorry. I'm sorry to interrupt you. We just got one thumbs up until now. So until we get five thumbs up, we're not going to share. I got two now. Three, I can see. Oh, you can see three? Yeah, there's one from Namita. I'm, I'm surprised to see there are a lot many uh, a team member from SaveMax who wants to know how to make $100,000. <laughs> I am making a list. That, I am making a list. That, that means we are, we are making them work a lot. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Kamal, you were saying something. Sorry, go ahead. Yeah, so I was uh, saying that uh, I just want to share the information. Hey, Kamal, sorry to interrupt you. I yeah. love this guy, Aiden. And <laughs> I put five thumbs up together. <laughs> he has a logic, right? You ask for five. You never ask that. You know, he same can, can cannot give five. See, this is, what, this is what I love. This is the beauty of the smart people. They yeah. all find out the creative ways. And Aiden, thank you very much. That is very creative. I love it. Gurmit put, but he, he put just four. So Gurmit, you're still missing one. Sorry, come on, you're saying something. Yeah. So, Gurmeet took actually one, both from hands and the legs, I suppose. So, that's why I said <laughs> <laughs> Okay. So, you know, idea here is just to share the information with everyone and I just leave it with them to decide. And we don't want to be pushy or anything. At times, what happens is like people, when they are getting into this business, they have to be just informed, you know. The information should be with them, whatever decision they're making. And guys, like I would say right now, uh, very, very strong uh, markets of GTA. We are just uh, planning to open our own offices, like say Vaughn, Scarborough. They are still vacant. And I would say if someone is looking towards those side of the things, just contact me on 416-333-8747. And I can give all the information. Plus, uh, for the gentleman who is in Vancouver, uh, I missed his name. I think I can't see. I think was he Gaurav? Yeah, yeah. Got yeah. Call on 416 and we can discuss for sure. Uh, so, uh, so, uh, sorry, uh, Kamal, I got an, another interesting answer from Prem Deep Singh uh, because there are some answer I can see here. Um, you know, the, the people who are actually watching us on uh, Save Max page, I can see all our answers there. But uh, Prem Deep Singh said, I asked some questions to my friends, same question to my friend, and they were thinking it's like joke. The thing I found this, do the work you love, you will not have to work again. It's a quote. So Premdeep Singh is saying, um, uh, you know, he actually spoke to a couple of his friends. And uh, 
they said it's a joke. No, no, uh, Premdeep, we are definitely going to talk about it, how to make $100,000 without working. And don't please, please don't take it uh, as a joke, right? Uh, I got another answer from Rajat. He says, make a team who can multiply themselves. Yes, Rajat, I, I, you know, I'm a firm believer of building up good teams out there. Uh, but to build up the team, you still have to work. And thank you, Simran. Simran is anxiously putting all the remarks and she is really keeping us alive. Simran says, today's live session is one of the best show till now. Love the suspense. Simran, we are not keeping the suspense. I'm definitely going to share it with you. How to make $100,000 without working. Uh, Deepak, uh, Rishav, there are so many. Come on, Sachin, what is happening today? I don't understand. Uh, Rishav has put up. You also made money without working. That shows. Sorry? We have a lot of people who want to make money without working. Sachin, tell me something interesting. Yes. Today's topic was, so let's talk about it now. Right? Guys, hold your horses, okay? Look how people, they are glued to the screen today. And everybody is anxious to know. Let, let me ask you another question before I talk about it. If the topic would have been how to make $100,000 by working hard, how many people would have joined today? Maybe you and me and Kamal. <laughs> Even Kamal was not coming. Yeah, Kamal <laughs> might not be there. <laughs> he might not have a choice because he will get the link and he has to join over there. <laughs> no, Kamal said no. But when I in the topics, I said, Kamal, I'm going to talk something interesting today. I'm going to talk about how to make $100,000 without working. And I know he was thinking on back of his mind. Come on, Raman is making me work so much. <laughs> and he's sharing the secret with others. <laughs> how to make $100,000 without working. So that is why he, and you know, he, he was very much onto it. Um, just when the said, talk to Kamal. <laughs> so if Kamal would have known, he wouldn't have joined the show today. <laughs> <laughs> we have an, another uh, very encouraging, interesting personality, Namita Singh. Uh, she's also with us today. She is, I met, I got a chance to meet her. I was so fascinated with her energy and, you know, she is such an amazing girl. And uh, I, I, I could get a feel that she is going to be an amazing success story under Save Max Banner. So Namita, keep up the good work. And uh, I am very hopeful that you will not let me down and you are definitely going to make a history in the real estate industry. Because personally, guys, to be very frank, I'm a firm believer about the women empowerment in the real estate industry. I think women should get more and more opportunity to come forward and join this wonderful profession because you guys can rock this. You guys can really change the dynamics of this industry. You can show people the true entrepreneurship, right? So that is very, very important. So Kamal, now let's talk about how to make hundred thousand dollars without working. Tell me something. I mean, yes. it's, that is the thing. No, the moment when I want to talk about it, you are asking me questions. Okay, ask me the question. Okay, so if this is known, then how? Why are we working? I mean, I was thinking here. Then probably three of us wouldn't be sitting here, right? So I mean, uh, for me, it is. Uh, I mean, uh, it's a puzzle or what? Like. Because I, I strongly believe that, uh, I mean, not working and can making... Can I can I take a call in between and you can talk yeah. and I'm going to just like, you know, uh, mute myself and I'm going to take a call? Yeah. So, you know, Sachin, what I'm trying to say is I'm not looking to make 100,000. I'm looking to make over... Or, so yes. It goes beyond that, right? So the yeah. equation says if you're looking to make 100,000, no, I'm looking to make more than that. So definitely I have to yeah. work, right? Yes. So, I mean, um, to me, it's still, I mean, I feel that you have to put your efforts, you know. Sorry, Kamal, it was an urgent call. And so I had to take it. So I wanted to make sure like, you know, everything is all good over there. So guys, uh, I'm pretty sure you all are very excited, very anxious about today's topic. How to make $100,000 without working. It's a pin drop silence here. 
I can I can feel the heartbeat of people. It's like really some of them is really like you know going on such a faster pace. It's like you know if you if you bring Usain Bolt right now, trust me, the heartbeat can be. You can check mine. You know, I'm I'm waiting for to get another hundred thousand dollars without working. <laughs> Forget about others. <laughs> so come on. Think about it, that how much research I do did before coming over here, over here. I went on Google to find a way to do it. I maybe asked two or three people to find a way to do it, and now I'm sitting in the session to get the answer. You know. Uh... I just it just reminded me of a discussion with one of a very big company and uh, the person who was owning the company he Kamal shared this who you go ahead I'm telling you everybody who's viewing the session is cursing you right now because you're asking question again and again <laughs> no I mean it is it is something which gave me a thought and I had a good discussion with this gentleman and he was talking about similar thing in one of the companies and he said like you have to do this and this all can happen without any brick or mortar and you don't need office and all everything then i asked him a question the person who is promoting is from where is he working is he having an office he said yes is he working with people he said yes and is he making that much money the answer was no then i was like little taken back then means you are trying to sell something which you are not doing so i mean i don't know raman how is this going to work <laughs> <laughs> look at look at such in space huh i cannot see other people's face but i can see such in space look <laughs> and you know what he is really anxious to know oh, definitely how, how to make 100000 without working i am not even trying to do so you know hide my emotions right now okay <laughs> so let's do let's do an another stuff there like you know i know we i have asked everybody to put a thumbs up but you know it is about money right so can i see five people putting up a dollar sign or putting up a you know the when you uh, uh, when you actually uh, put a, a money or the dollar you type it and then there is a you know a pack of dollars shows up so can i can i ask five people to put up either a dollar sign or the real dollars over there i could have done that if i had the access <laughs> okay <laughs> uh, kamal um, yeah. Somebody is uh, SGSG saying you're you're looking tired. Are you tired today? <laughs> Maybe you were working late night yesterday. <laughs> what is tiring? <laughs> <laughs> no, no. Kamal is a very high energy uh, personality, and I always admire him for that. And uh, Deepak, at least you should not do that. Deepak wants to know how to make hundred thousand dollar without working. I thought you are a hardworking guy, and that is why I chose you to. Become the flag bearer in Alberta, and you are asking that I'm I'm really gonna be calling you right after this show, Deepak. You are in in big trouble. Oh, so <laughs> Sachin, yeah, we have actually uh, had an achievement. It is saying congratulations. You have received hundred messages today with restream chat. Wow. Uh, <laughs> Deepak is saying everybody loves free money. Deepak, I think I, uh, with respect, I disagree with that statement. I don't love free money in my life. So you cannot say everyone, okay? So I, I'm definitely going to call you. Uh, Raman, I also, I'm also hardworking, but want to listen to you. So just when I really appreciate hardworking people, and I think, uh, um, you know, hard work. There is no substitute to it. Uh, I, I wake up at four o'clock in the morning and I pretty much uh, work until eight or nine o'clock in the evening and sometime even later than that uh, because I, I feel energetic. I feel like my work gives me more energy and uh, everybody have their own way of thinking in their life. But I personally feel uh, the real definition of success is when you can create success for others. Um, you cannot, uh, I can see a message from Raj Sharma. You cannot make 100,000 without working. You need to work. Uh, SGST said we don't like free money either. So, guys, I'm pretty sure you all might have seen today's topic, today's heading, which says 
how to make hundred thousand dollars without working. If the question would have been how to make hundred thousand dollars with hard work, I'm pretty sure only me and Sachin and maybe Sachin would have skipped the show for today. Come on, I'm pretty sure he wouldn't have been here. There are only things where I don't have options. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, this was not which was I am I was going to share something from my side. I asked you a question. I asked you guys the question how to make hundred thousand dollars without working. So that was a question to all of you. Yes, yes, yes. Just, just didn't put the question mark behind that. I just put the question mark behind that. <laughs> so I was also trying to find out how to make hundred thousand dollars without working, but I couldn't find it. And you all actually supported my thought process that if you want to make hundred thousand dollars, you have to work hard for that. If somebody is coming and telling you guys that you can make money without working, it is absolutely, absolutely a lie. It is not even possible in any aspect of the life where you can make money without working and see. This is what I wanted to prove to all of you that there are so many people who just came together glued to the screens when somebody just said how to make hundred thousand dollars without working. So how easy it was for a person, for a dumb person like me to keep you onto the screens for one hour. But I don't have any way, I don't have any formula where somebody can make money without working. Not really. Guys, even if you just have to pick up that money, you still have to work for that. You still have to uh, extend your hand to pick up that money. Right? And, and we all have to, Raman, we all have to understand that, you know, when we're talking about a six figure income, less than 2% Canadians make that kind of income. Absolutely. Absolutely. Right. Yeah. And we should, not have, we should not carry that thought process that, you know what, we can achieve with which less than 2% of Canadians are, are achieving by working so hard. And we can do that without moving or without doing anything. Uh, Sachin, I, I definitely want to uh, respect and appreciate Amir. And I love his remarks. He said, we came to see you and Kamal, not the $100,000. I mean, I really, really appreciate. And I know that. From the bottom of my heart, I definitely know that, that you all came just because we we talk about something interesting every week. It was not that topic, but still, I wanted to, I'm pretty sure you all got my message. I'm pretty sure you all enjoyed today's show. I think that was more important, right? Isn't it like, you know, everybody's heartbeat was, was palpating on a, on a very high pace and everybody wanted to know. Sometimes, guys, it's good to have fun in the life. Sometimes we learn lesson in a different way. And I think if you all watch today's show, you all are going to promise me that we all are going to work hard, not only to make our own lives better, but our family's life better, our friends, our community, our society, our city, our province, our country. We all will promise, make a promise to ourselves that we are going to work hard to make a wonderful life. We are going to make our life meaningful because nature, God, whatever you believe on has chosen you to come on this beautiful planet Earth. And I think that will be in the real senses, the purpose of coming us over here and contributing to other people's life. So please make sure guys, thank you very much. I really appreciate all of you joining the session today and let's all take this message home that there is nothing and never ever expect in your life. Never ever ask from anybody for anything for free or for uh, without working hard for that because you know, you know, you're not really going to enjoy it. And I loved some of the answer where people said, if you love what you do, it means you're not working. 
And absolutely, I 100% agree on to that. Yes, that could be one of the perspective of life where we are thinking that, you know what? I'm not working at all. I'm still making money. Thank you very much to all of you for joining for today's interesting session. I am pretty sure you all had some fun. You all, and I'm happy that I was able to glue you in front of the screen for almost one hour and see how many, how much interesting discussion we had. Every time we don't want to talk about real estate. Sometimes it's good to have fun. Right, Sachin? That's right, Raman. So Kamal, I hope you got the answer. And I oh, know yeah. you're a very hardworking guy. <laughs> Thanks, Raman. Thank you. Thank you, guys. Thank you very much for joining for today's uh, session. Uh, we will definitely bring some another interesting topic next week. But I all I want all of you to participate and bring your thought process. Maybe we can make this one hour productive, a fun, fun time for all of us. And also we can do a lot of learning from each other. Have an amazing weekend, friends. See you next week, sharp at 12 o'clock. And don't forget to send me your message that how did you like today's show? If you liked it, if you had some good fun, please don't hesitate to share with others so that they all can get the secret how to make $100,000 without working. Thank you very much and have an amazing weekend, boys. Thank you. Thanks, Thank you. Thank you, everybody, and have an amazing weekend.